All right, we got the father-son duo here with us, uh, trainer Brett Wilfong, driver Kyle Wilfong. Uh, we're going to talk about Brett's horses in tonight. We'll start off with race three, number two, some heartthrob. Uh, Brett, the well-bred colt looks like a good one. Tell us how you got him and how he trained down. Well, we were trying to buy a some beach colt for at the sales the last couple of years, and uh, they were pretty expensive, so... Uh, we bought this colt. He was lightly raced. Bought him uh, at the Harrisburg sale in November, and we got twenty thousand for him. He had raced a little, won a race, showed a little talent, and um, we trained him up for a month or six weeks. Put him in to qualify, and Kyle really liked him. And the horse has gotten better over the last three or four starts, and looks like he he might be all right. All right, Kyle. We'll uh, we'll ask you here. His first win last week was a tough fought victory in the slop. Uh, how did he race, and, and did you think he should have cleared a little early last week? Yeah, he raced really good. I thought he should have cleared, but uh, uh, the kid that was inside of me had his hand holds maybe just a little too far back, and his horse was on the line, so he was in a little bit of trouble. Brett, we'll go back to you. Uh, what is what is what do you got this one staked to, and what's the plan for this one long term? Well, we didn't we didn't really extensively stake him because he tried a little bit of that last year. And, on the east coast and he didn't he didn't really fare too well so we put him in the Hanover in the Circle City and and there might be something else here in March that we might put him into but you know we we kind of bought him with the idea we might breed him to a couple of our Cape Crusader fillies he is still a stud and he was out of a mare that won over a half a million so uh, and he's a well-mannered horse so that's kind of the plan Nice. Uh, Kyle, he looks to be in a great spot tonight. Uh, what's uh, what's the game plan? Uh, we might just see how he goes off the gate and go from there. He uh, he went parked the mile last week, so it would be nice to see if we could get a little easier trip than that. All right. For uh, Brett Wilfong and Kyle Wilfong, this is Jeremy Day for the Illinois Harness Horseman Association live at Maywood Park. Send it back up to you, Joe. All right, J.D., we've got action. More action coming away. Third race coming up next we have no changes in this race. We welcome the 12th District. They're here tonight. It's the 12th District Night at the Races. Exact trifecta. Superfecto wagering coming up here on the third race. 